Yes, thanks for having me. Yes, good. And good morning. Good morning. So, uh, explain to us really what this phenomenon means. All right. So, just just like you explained, um, this is the time of the year when the sun is farther away from from the earth. Okay. And what happens is that the sun is the basic driver of all the weather conditions that we get um, across the globe. And so, areas where you have the sun. That is the areas you expect a lot of convection to happen, a lot of cloud formation, and a lot of rainfall in these areas. And um, when you're getting the sun farther away from you, it means that technically you're getting some higher pressure build up in that area. And they suppress more of the activities. What you see most of the time is that um, higher pressures build over the ocean, and we get lower pressures very oh, far in land, like around Northern area. Africa, the area there about. And so winds move from the ocean to feed that low pressure in the northern portions of Africa. So we get a lot of cloud cover around that time. And so you, if you've realized, you see that July, I guess, and early part of September, there's a lot of cloud cover for most places in the country. Because of that, we get um, the sun's rays blocked from getting to the surface of the earth. And so temperatures tend to be naturally cool around that time. That's what makes the month of August the coolest month in the year. So that's what we are seeing. It's not something that is extraordinary. It's not going to cause um, any, any devastating effect. Just that for people who are sensitive to cold weather, they will have some bit of um, unsettlement. And so they would have to um, adapt to the conditions that, that would be experienced around the time. Mm. Are we expecting more rains within this season? Yes, we still expect some rain, but like I said earlier, because this kind of condition brings a lot of higher pressures for, for us, especially in the southern part of Ghana, around this time into August, we call it the little dry season. So it's not the dry season itself, but then it does not give us a lot of rainfall. The kind of rainfall we see from now till the end of August will mainly be the drizzle kind or the slight rain intermittent season. Uh, you don't expect most of the more more of the heavy rainfall, the convective rain around this time. Areas where we expect more rain to be seen now will be the northern portions of Ghana. Mm. So the upper east, northeast, north. There are five northern regions and part of the transition zone. That's where we we'll still see the thunderstorms, the lightning flashes, and all of that. But for us in southern Ghana, the kind of rains that we'll be seeing now will be the slight rain, the drizzle, more car cover, more cool temperatures but less amount of rainfall around this time. At least that's good news for the northern part of the country since they've been complaining um, a while now about reduced rainfall. But thank you very much, Joshua Samoa, senior forecaster with the Ghana Meteorological Agency. Well